Let's solve one previous question of stack. This question was asked in GATE CS 2024 set 2 question number 38. Let S1 and S2 be two stacks. S1 has capacity of four elements. S2 has capacity of two elements. S1 already has four elements 100, 200, 300 and 400. Whereas S2 is empty as shown below. This is S1. This is S2. S1 have four elements. S2 is empty. Only the following three operations are available. First, push to S2. Pop the top element from S1 and push it on S2. Next, push to S1. Pop the top element from S2 and push it on S1. Generate output. Pop the top element from S1 and output it to the user. Note that the pop operation is not allowed on an empty stack and the push operation is not allowed on a full stack. Which of the following output sequence can be generated by using above operations and four options are given. We need to check one by one option whether it is possible or not. Option A 100, 200, 400, 300. First, we will do push to S2. Means we will pop 400 from S1 and we will push to S2. Next, again we will do push to S2. So, we will pop 300 from S1 and we will push to S2. Now, if we will do generate output, it will generate 200, not 100. So, 100 cannot be popped before 200 that's why option a is not possible next option b 200 300 400 100 so this set of operations we can execute over this let me execute one by one push to s2 we have to stack s1 and s2 s1 already have 100 200 300 400 and s2 is empty so push to s2 it will pop 400 and it will push to s2 next push to s2 it will pop 300 and push to S2. Next, generate output. It will pop 200 and it will generate output. Then push to S1. So it will pop 300 from S2 and push to S1. Then generate output. It will pop 300 from S1 and generate 300. Next number is 400. So we will do push to S1. We will pop from S2 and will push to stack S1 then generate output it will generate 400 next generate output it will generate 100 so this sequence 200 300 400 100 is possible next option C 400 200 100 300 so let me execute this sequence of operation on stack first is 400 so directly we can generate output from S1 so generate output 400 next is 200 so what we will do push to S2 so that will pop 300 and push to stack S2 we need to show 200 so generate output 200 next number is 100 so we can do generate output 100 next is 300 so we need to do push to s1 that will pop from stack s2 and push to s1 then generate output so it will pop 300 from s1 and so as output so 400 200 100 300 is possible next option d 300 200 400 and 100 so the sequence of operation that we can execute over this we have to stack s1 and s2 first output is 300 so we will do push to s2 pop 400 from s1 and we will push to s2 next generate output 300 next generate output 200 after 200 we need to show 400 push to s1 will pop from stack s2 and push to s1 generate output pop 400 from s1 and it will show as output next generate output it will pop 100 and show as output so 300 200 400 and 100 is possible from the option option a is not possible whereas option b option c and option d are possible that's why answer will be option b option c and option 
D. This is simple. Just you need to check all the option whether it is possible or not by executing on the stack. If this lecture is helpful for you, please like, share and subscribe. Thank you.